Dawn. Good evening and welcome to 3D. Bubby. You can't go out, you know. We don't have a baby. I've noticed that. We're not likely to have one either. Companies are using electronic anyway, who'd want to raise a family in this dump? Even their own employees. The government. Uh-oh. Here comes the lecture. We've been here seven days. Ah, oh, no. I scratch them on the bedroom walls. Look, I thought coming out to the sticks to live would be a load of fun. They have a few trees to look at. You'd be in before 11 every night, but it ain't going to be like that, is it? If I'm going to be on my own, I'd rather be in London. I'll tell you, Denton, Frank, is... I haven't got time to argue with you! Exactly. Don't bother waking up! Myself. I mean, Billy helped me. You know, he was so lovely to me that I realised that it wasn't my fault. I couldn't be as bad as what Trevor was saying. I mean, if I was, then Billy would love me if I was that bad. No, it was Billy made me see Trevor for what he really was. He was a bully. It was like opening my eyes and seeing everything differently for the first time all at once. You know, once I've done that, Knew it was over. You're pathetic. Get out of my way. Pathetic, come on. Oh, what are you going to do with that? Did you know that? Uh, no, because to do something like that, you need guts. Oh, I'll tell you. Oh, you're waiting for me to beg. Well, you're going to have a long wait. Like I said, no guts. You're not the one out there, I swear. Are you stupid? Are you not listening to me? I'm not! Frightened of you any more! I swear to that! Oh, what you gonna do? Hey, 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 you gonna do this? You did. Why? I thought this is what you wanted. You weren't gonna do it, were you? This is all to scare me into doing what you wanted. No. What was it, Trevor? Pour a bit of petrol around. Make her frightened. Make her beg. Make her come back to you. You're a sad, pathetic little man. I don't know why they're afraid of you. Get out! <laughs> you all loved him as much as I did in the beginning. You remember? Yeah. Dad thought the sun shone out of his bum. Didn't it? What was it that changed him then? I don't know. He said it was when Mum died. What? Oh, he didn't have any family. When Mum got ill, he felt left out. He thought I put you lot before him. But Mum was dying. Well, I know, but I was all he had. I was never there. Is that when he started eating you? Not long after, yeah. I don't know why you put up with it for as long as you did. Well, I don't know myself now, I look back on it. I suppose I didn't know no better. I am not Trevor, what are you doing here? I've come to take you home. But I'm open That's my girl. You look beautiful. I'm tired of messing up more. I lost you because of my temper. You haven't lost me. Do you mean that? Well, as long as you get better, I'll give it another go. Look, Trevor, if you're the big. Do yourself a favour more. Shut your eyes. <laughs> you're not going to do this to me, you bitch. 
You're not gonna hold on to me! I can't believe you let me to you. I'll never touch you again. Never. I love you. guilty of attempted murder. Guilty. No! No! The period of your imprisonment shall be eight years. <laughs> He was so lovely to me that I realised that it wasn't my fault. I couldn't be as bad as what Trevor was saying. I mean, if I was, then Billy would love me, would he, if I was that bad? No, no. It was Billy made me see Trevor for what he really was. He was a bully. It was like opening my eyes and seeing everything differently for the first time all at once. You know, once I'd done that, I knew it was over. You're pathetic. Get out of my way. Pathetic, am I? Oh, what are you going to do with those? You know where. No, because to do something like that, you need guts. Oh, I'll do it. Oh, oh, you're waiting for me to beg? Well, you're going to have a long wait. Like I said, no guts. You're not the one I've Are you stupid? Are you not listening to me? I'm not frightened of you any more! I swear I'm dead! Oh, what you gonna do? Hey, 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 you gonna do this? You dead. Why? I thought this is what you wanted. You weren't gonna do it, were you? This is all to scare me into doing what you wanted. No. What was it, Trevor? Pour a bit of petrol around. Make her frightened. Make her beg. Make her come back to you. You're a sad, pathetic little man. I don't know why I was afraid of you. you like ah! that. Oh, he didn't have any family. When Mum got here, we felt left out. He thought I'd put you lot before him. But Mum was dying. Well, I know, but I was all he had. I was never there. Is that when he started eating you? Not long after, yeah. I don't know why you put up with it for as long as you did. Well, I don't know myself now I look back on it. I suppose I didn't know no better. <laughs> I've come to take you home. That's my girl. You look beautiful. I'm tired of messing up, Mom. I lost you because of my temper. You haven't lost me. Do you mean that? Well, as long as you get better, I'll give it another go. Look, Trevor, if you're going to be... Do yourself a favour, Mom. Shut your mouth. <laughs> You're not gonna do this to me, you bitch. 
You're not gonna hold out on me! I can't believe the way I've treated you. I'll never touch you again. Never. I love you. Well, I hate you. Thank you.